everybody, welcome to Tour of Italy on Celebrity Wine Review TV. I'm your host, Tiffany Hendra, here with our very special guest and tour guide, and might I add, quite charming and good-looking Italian <laughs> hunk, Fabio Viviani. Well, Tiffany, you're telling me that we're gonna take a Tour of Italy together. Yes! How fun! Are you last, ready? Last time I took a Tour of Italy, no one there was looking any close on the way that you look. And I'm very thrilled about this. Well, thank you. Brownie <laughs> points. Major brownie points. Major brownie <laughs> points. I love it. I love it. So on Tour of Italy, we are going to discover different wine regions. Yes. The cuisine, the culture. the culture, and more importantly, the wine. Absolutely. Yeah. And I will add that what I'm going to do, I'm going to add the element of you know being there i know a lot about the culture i know a lot about the food but what i understand is that you will take care of the wine i am are, are you ready are you ready no I'm i grew ready. up with those wines so you better bring your a game on okay Flavor. I wasn't this excited the day of my wedding. Welcome to Tour of Italy on Celebrity Wine Review TV. I'm your host, Tiffany Hendra, here with our very special guest and quite dapper, Fabio Viviani. Thank you very much, wow. Tiffany. You look stunning tonight, so I couldn't just rely on a simple button shirt. Awesome. I had to put something else on it. Well, it's very sharp. Thank you very much. So on every episode of Tour of Italy, you take us on an adventure through a different wine region. We talk about the culture, the cuisine, the, the wine. wine. So today, the team at Celebrity Wine Review TV has chosen a beautiful wine from the Piemonte region. Gaia, Gaia Barbaresco. Okay, say so that again, Barbaresco. Barbaresco. Pronunciation, nail on the head, ten, 10 plus. Gaia Barbaresco, <laughs> in my belief, doesn't raise the bar of what an Italian important red wine is. This wine is mm, the bar. Wow. Now, G Gaia uh, is the name of the wine. Barbaresco is named after the city of Barbaresco in Piedmont, okay. which is, it's a little, uh, it's, it's a corner. Well, yeah, village, yeah. but to me it's more like a corner of paradise. The Piedmont is a very vast region. Mm -hmm. It's one of the biggest in Italy. It has hills, mountain, lots of water so the the selection of dishes traditional that i could possibly make was a lot thanks to this one narrow it narrow down, down because you know this is like a ferrari not everybody can drive it this is the ferrari of the wine not everybody can drink okay. it okay so we have to make sure that the food will live up to standard okay today since we're going to do things a little bit differently we've got the wine it's very special it's a special occasion wine so now you have got to come up with a special dish. I am very excited. That's worthy, of course, of the wine. Well, I can you handle it? I so far I had to come up with dishes that was worth it. Your presence. Now I also have a guy at Barbaresco on the table. I think you can do it. I can, and I'm gonna go back in my kingdom and see if I can pull something off. And I'm just gonna sit here in my glory Please. and wait. Done. Piemonte, now this time Tiffany throw me a curveball. Uh, she popped on the table a bottle of Gaia Barbaresco. Now I was thinking what can I do with it, but I know a dish, uh, tajarin with braised quail, that I can prep for her will go extremely well with the Barbaresco. Also because the recipe called for red wine to braise the quail. Now, I know you're gonna use a Barbaresco to braise quail, that I will go to hell for it. I'm gonna use just a regular Piedmontese red wine. I have some quail. Now I do have to make my own fresh pasta. Now, in order to make fresh pasta, you need eggs. You need about one, you need about one egg per person. So in this case, I'm using four eggs. And you need like a food processor, just like this one. 
You need a pinch of salt. You need some pepper. Now, I have salt, I have pepper, I have eggs. I'm gonna use a little bit of olive oil, just a touch, and some flour. Now, it's about a cup, cup to a quart per eggs, but Piedmontese tradition doesn't give you the recipe for the fresh pasta. Only teaches you how to make it plain by ear, and that's what we're gonna do. You will see that the pasta has to be solid enough to not be sticky, but yet softer to be able to go through the rolling pin. Now, it's very easy to make. This is pretty much ready. Now, it's still a little too wet. So we gotta add some flour here. The gluten in the flour is gonna be activated by the motion of the blade, and soon this will be one organic lamp. Watch. God, you got to love tradition. Look at this. Fresh pasta. Now I have my fresh pasta. I'm gonna let the rest underneath the towel. And we go for the quail. Quail is a very delicate bird. Little gamey, and there is a lot of quail farm in the Piedmont area. Salt and pepper, extra virgin olive oil, and we're gonna braise this one. Some garlic cloves. Some rosemary and some sage. Done. Now, and we're gonna make our tajarine. You have to use a little flour on your hand. Get the dough. Get a piece of it. And see how fast this is, guys. It's unbelievable. Make good food. This is very easy, look. And for a, such a sophisticated wine, this time, I'm sure the Tiffany will be very impressed. I am so excited about this wine. The Gaia Barbadesco is the flagship wine of the Gaia Winery. And this winery was founded in 1859 by Giovanni Gaia. Now, the Barbadesco is flamboyant, it's intense and suave, just like its maker. I saw the light in Fabio's eyes when he realized that this was the wine we were highlighting today. So I cannot wait to see what he's made for us. There is all kinds of action in there. I hear cutting and grinding and all kinds of stuff. So. I know he has fond memories of Piemonte, so I cannot wait to see what he has prepared for us today. Here we go. This is the best part. Look how easy is this. Check this out. And I'm gonna do the handmade one, okay? Because not everybody has the machine, and I wanna be fair. Look. Now, this is what Italian food is about. The simplicity of the food with the complexity of a wine like Gaia Barbaresco. Now, we take care of the quail. They're nice and brown. Now we got to braise them. Red wine. and uh, an amazing veal reduction. We have fresh pasta, tagerine, we have the braised quail. I hope that Tiffany is gonna bring her A game on it because this guy about braised is going down. This is so exciting. You sounded really busy in there. Uh, I was. <clears throat> I was chasing quail, I was making <laughs> pasta. I think I, I was, heard one. <laughs> I had my little war there, but I won. 
You did good. I said, you know, it's an important wine. Mm -hmm. You have a cocktail dress. I cannot just come up with two simple things. So I made my fresh pasta, rolled it, and cut it. Fresh? Fresh, from scratch. I didn't know you could do that. I thought you'd buy mm. it in the little box. And I'm a chef, so <laughs> chef can do that. And then I had uh, farm um, cage-free quail, mm -hmm. and I braised them with red wine, of course, no. Not the, the Barbaresco. Not the no. Barbaresco. Yeah. But I said, you know, it's an important wine. This is one of the Piemontese staple mm. in the cuisine. Tagliarin is the Piemontese dialect translation for Taglierini, which is angel air. Okay, okay. And uh, yeah, I mean, I, I gotta do this. Let's I'm sorry, you know, we're, we're talking, you. but we, we have to do this because this wine open sitting, it's gonna like be perfect. A, it's like a gorgeous car parked in the garage. It's not worth it. Well, let's take it out. Let's take so, it for a spin. Salute. Salute. Okay, totally lives up to all the hype from before. That is good. I am very that happy. is good. I am very happy in yeah. this moment. Let me, let me serve you some of this. Okay. You know, this is two firsts for me. I've never had the Barbaresco. I I've never, never had quail. I never, uh, this is my first time drinking Barbaresco. Today. Liar. Today. <laughs> <laughs> no, of course, oh please. I, I would sell my house if I needed the money to buy this one. What you want to do is this. You get the quail. It's a high-end chicken. It's a high-end, mm. small version of a chicken. And look. O-M-G, wow, that is so good. And this will be my first, I do believe, three firsts at this table. So you never had fresh pasta like no. that? No. What, really? No. Come on, we should, we should do. In we America, no done, one makes fresh pasta. We should have pasta. done a background check I don't even know Come if I'm on. doing this right. I'm kind of surprised right. here. Okay, just stick it in. So you're gonna grateful for me, with me forever for okay. this. Yeah, please. I'm in heaven right now, just so you guys know. I'm with the angels, they're flapping their wings. I think at this very All moment, you have to carry the show on and keep talking, I'm busy drinking. Wow. Well, this is a very special wine, which calls for a special toast. What do you got for me? Well, what I would say is uh, per gli amici, per il cibo, mm -hmm. and per il vino, which mean for new friendship, mm -hmm. for awesome food, and amazing wine. Oh. Salute. I, I, I'm, I'm gonna bring it. I can handle it. Half liver. I wasn't this excited the day of my wedding. Thank you.